Jeff. And now to a couple of high-end heists, one in Hillsborough County and one in Miami. New video shows the botched robbery attempt at a town and country jewelry store, and tonight the owner of that store is speaking out. News Channel 8's Melissa Marino is on Sheldon Road in town and country where it happened. Melissa. Hey, good evening. Yeah, these thieves, they certainly had their eyes on some high-end things, including a safe filled with jewelry here from this store and some high-end bags from Miami. Crooks with an eye for the finer things. Easy pay, pay job, three minutes, in and out. Uh, a lot of money. Video shows a group of thieves smashing their way into the deluxe jewelers in town and country back in March. So they use a big crowbar to open the door and to hit the camera, the, the, the ring camera that I had outside. Uh, once they got in, they start pushing the cases around. Store owner Carlos Enrique says the thieves went straight for the safe. Tried to load it on the truck and it took them a little bit there, but once they went, I guess they were in a rush and the safe just fell out of the truck. The thieves took off, leaving the safe on the ground. I think the police was coming at that point. That's why they, were, they left in such a rush. Days later, police say the same group of thieves broke into a store in Miami Beach. Video shows them filling garbage cans with 60 Hermes Birkin designer handbags worth nearly $2 million. The same guys were robbed the Miami store and the connection was the car. They used the same car to go pick up the, the bags. Police arrested the owner of the vehicle connected to both robberies, Eduardo Garcia. Thankfully, Carlos says he got all of his jewelry back, but the thieves caused thousands in damage to his store. He wants all of them held accountable. These people are still out there, like, why? Garcia is facing several charges, including grand theft. Stacy? 